Welcome back to The Month of Paradox with 90secondphilosophyandcarnades.org. Today we're going to be looking at an outlining of the four paradoxes that are going to define the four groups of paradoxes that we're going to be taking a look at over the course of this month. These are, in fact, the famous four paradoxes of Eubulides. They are the paradox of the horned man, the paradox of the hooded man, the paradox of the heap, and the paradox of the liar. In this video, we're just going to be taking a look at a general understanding of these paradoxes, and we'll get more in depth when we do those specific videos. First off, the horned man. What you have not lost, you still have. You have not lost your horns, therefore you have horns. We're going to be looking at general paradoxes in this first category, in this first section, kind of some paradoxes that wouldn't fit in any of the other sections. Next up, the paradox of the heap. We've already looked at this one. One grain of sand is not a heap. Adding a grain of sand to a non-heap cannot make a heap. You'll never make a heap of sand, because this talks about grouping of things. We're going to be talking about set theory paradoxes in conjunction with the heap in the Sorites paradox. Next up, the paradox of the hooded man. You do not know the man in the hood who's approaching you, but you know your father. If your father approaches you in a hood, you both do and do not know him, because we're talking about paradoxes of knowledge here. This is going to lead into our third section, our section on epistemic paradoxes, and finally, my favorite, the liar paradox, which is just I'm lying. And we're going to use it as a lead into the many different versions of liar paradoxes that are out there. But first up, we will take a look more in depth at the horned man paradox and lead into some general paradoxes. Watch a new video on paradoxes every single day this month here at Carnades.org and stay skeptical, everybody.